Your own mommy, mommy check out there. Ah, eh, we, honey stars, honey stars, my children. Thank you so much. I'm so proud of you. Thank you, my honey stars. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Tim. Check us for this wonderful birthday gift. I'm so proud of you all. Thank you. You have made my day the beautiful day the Lord has made for me. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. May God bless all of you in Jesus' name. Amen. Shout out to you. Welcome to this video. Yes, let's start this video. Even though it's a basketball video, let's start with uh, Onyeke's mother. She celebrated her birthday on uh, Sunday. Yes sunday so happy belated birthday to her and uh onyeka fans surprised her with the lovely flowers and balloons to celebrate her day um, it's good to have big fan base oh. <laughs> and making sure that that big fan base they are financially you know financially good financially buoyant to find some of those things for you so yes uh they did an amazing this was really a lovely gesture from them kudos to them i'm looking forward to the gifts uh you know that will, they'll be giving to their fave this season even though it is the pain season yeah now let's move to the best balls of this video yeah remember when uh i was giving tips on when you go into big brother house what you should do what you should not do when you look uh how you look at and the things you should practically do to be able to win the show i gave tips on that now i think some most of you did not watch that video i i well the mistake that you know wani and uh handy did was to talk about ex-housemates and to be frank with you eh? to be very frank and very logical like i always see on this channel whatever handy or wani said about ex-housemates were not in a malicious way they were not malicious in whatever way at all if you want to look at it without putting emotions in it they were not malicious they were not be they, they were not malicious at all that's basically what it is now what they said was in level up it seems to them that you know even though beauty left in week, week two she's doing well and she's still trending down Fina. That was really not malicious. I mean, if you have, if you're a fan, you see it as normal. But obviously, Big Brother Niger fans do not take things like that lightly. Especially if you claim somebody is doing better than the other, and the one who is not doing better as you claim is the winner of her season. Definitely, her fans, her passionate fans, will come after you. I understand totally now that conversation did not end there they went ahead to talk about Mercy AK Mercy AK has been in the game for five years and she still have dedicated fans like passionate fans Mercy AK is an OG BB and housemate Omo, <laughs> you can't come for Mercy AK when her fans are still intact never that has been proven in the all-star season so what one said was that Mercy AK came to All Stars and she gave absolutely nothing. She was kissing this, she was kissing that person, she gave absolutely nothing. And she thought she was trending. Meanwhile, Ilibaye was trending. <laughs> These are the words of Wani. So obviously, Mercy AK fans were also holding on to that and saying, Look, Omo. This girl is not going to win. Hmm. <laughs> then the last thing she said was about Ile Baye as well. She said Ile Baye did not deserve to win. Ile Baye won because it was pity. <sighs> Guys, <laughs> after even seeing all this, I think that was a lot. That was a lot to say about ex-housemate. And 
these are all female winners hmm this is bad market man this was really bad market so when she lost on sunday these are the tweets from uh Ilebaye and fina congratulations kelly ray a crowned well crowned <laughs> that is a tweet from fina then Ilebaye also said like i said when grace meets grace uh at the end of the day you can't take the crown and uh google will tell you uh big brother niger all stars winner you when you have god by your side nothing can bring you down you keep winning and living uh isaiah 46 verse 4 i have made you i will carry you i will sustain you and i will rescue you be working ah <laughs> where can i start from where can i continue from where do i end this video guys i've been telling you guys that when you go into the house leave ex-housemate alone then this tweet says uh that was a response from uh, you know one of our you know wani fans that says Ilebaye is a f b <laughs> good <laughs> oh guys this this is funny i really you know what what <laughs> yeah i keep laughing because housemates do not learn like stop if you're not going to say anything positive what like i said it was not even anything malicious but if you were going to say something against another if you're, if you're going to pin uh ex-housemate together huh, let me put it that way compare pin and you know differentiate and prefer this housemate to that housemate if you're going to be talking about housemate in those light or more you need to shut it you need to shut up your mouth to be on the safer side stop talking about ex big brother niger housemate when you enter big brother niger house simple to be at the safer side so that was all they said and trust me, people who were still very passionate about their previous housemate stood their ground and did not support Wani ex handy. And that was really sad because, uh, you know, this housemate actually gave us content. They actually gave us something to talk about. Um, Wani, Handy, Sean, Unyeka, and uh, who Ozzy, this this five housemates gave us something to talk about. They give us, you know, they give us raw materials to 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 deal with, and for fans not to reward them for, you know, to win. That was really really sad. Someone said Nigerians cannot be saved from mental slavery. And I think I kind of agree because you can give all your best, and then uh they give the winner to someone again uh like he was he led by or oh, yeah like he led by said grace meet grace sometimes to you know uh monkey the way babu the chop that's exactly what i played out here people give content for us to talk about then viewers chose their own winner and that was kelly Ray. congratulations to him anyway but yeah that is what um uh ile baye and fina gotta say regarding uh x one and when i say dragon they are i mean x one fans are many like they have huge fun you, i mean you guys saw the percentage on sunday so they actually do have a huge they are the second you know he from this yes so uh, yeah so they were dragging ile baye and fina and trust me these are also two stubborn people they went, they locked their account, they came back. Actually, it was only Libaye who locked her account and came back today again. Then we also have 
Fina, who is already a stubborn fly, like you can't hurt her, she will keep coming back. You guys all saw what she did to Multi Choice last year. Was it this year or last year? Anywho, you saw what she did. The dragon was not here. Hmm. So, because of Fina, <laughs> these brands are doing what they're supposed to do give the gift, give the presentation to the housemate. Uh, guys, I was really entertained. I was really, really, really entertained. And uh, I don't know what you guys think about this whole drama, Fina and uh, Lebaye, you know, dragging, ex uh, dragging Wani. What do you guys think? For me, like I said, it wasn't really malicious, but if you are pinning ex housemate against another ex housemate, the one that is in the negative, like their fans will come for you. It's like that. The positive one will support you, but make sure that the negative ones do not have a bigger fan base because some of those turn you for life and uh that is exactly what is is playing out here i feel sorry for them but it is what it is when you go into big brother house learn to shut out your mouth and stop talking about ex big brother niger house me just keep it shut talk about yourself talk about your journey talk about joe's talk about there are lots, so many things to talk about if he's not in a positive light, don't talk about ex housemate to be at the safer side. So, guys, <laughs> tell me what you guys also think about this whole drama in the comment section. I'll see you all in the next video.